and he's acting like a two-year-old instead of a three-year-old. We have his tractor cake in front of us. Okay, you just be grateful. Elizabeth. Brittany. Brittany's going to go to here. Fascinated with his birthday cake. Do you want to have Grandma in your tractor cake on them? This is his. Show, show Grandma the tractor cake. Show her on the video. I told you. She's got the video camera. She's videoing it. Tell me about the tractor cake, Calvin. How many tractors are there? Two. Two tractors? Yeah. How old are you? Ten. You're thirty. Is it your birthday today? Yeah, I pick it up. No, don't pick at it. Are we gonna go to the fire station? This is happy birthday, big boy. Yeah. He loves his Uncle Robert. That's a very good smile. Good smile. Hey, Let me see it. Can we have a bite?
Who told me? Oh, I used to. Go over there and no, play, you guys. No, we're all going dancing. They're going to come with us. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Lisa is here. Steve. Yeah, I'm going to do the whole thing. Are you okay, 
Calvin? Look at that big coat. Calvin. Okay, we have this hood here that that protects our our ears and stuff, so our ears don't burn up. Yeah. It looks like a race car driver. They wear those too. We have our big coat here. Is that hot? Underneath all Very that? hot. <laughs> what kind of material is it? Do we know? What's that? What kind of material? It's called PVI. It's it's made. It's uh. It'll burn as long as there's fire on it. But as soon as you take the fire away, it goes out. Does it feel like cotton or what does it feel like? And this stuff is the same stuff. This is uh. These are PVI. No, I think these are PVI. Yeah. That coat is supposed to be able to withstand flame at four, up to 482 degrees. So if you're, we just have to take a test, and that's one of the questions they ask is how much heat can these things re, retard before they, they catch on fire on a direct flame at 482 degrees. That's, that's a bit. <laughs> Some houses, the fires burn 1,000 to 1,300 degrees. Okay, and we have our, our air mask on. They don't recognize us. So when they're stuck in the house and, and we're in there looking for them to get them out away from the fire, they don't recognize us as firemen and they hide from us. So I want you guys to see what we look like with our mask on so you know that we're good guys and we're there to save you. Kind of like Uncle Mark, huh, Calvin? Uh -huh. Does Uncle Mark walk around with a mask on his face all the time? He's in his mess of screaming all the time. Yeah. Yeah. Look, Calvin. Mm -hmm. Looky, Calvin. Tyson, look. Look at his mask. Hi. Hi, Tyson. Hi, Tyson. Tyson. Hey. Look behind you. Hi, Tyson. Hey. Come here, Tyson. Put his helmet on. Hi, guys. Got their attention now. Okay, and then, because it's hot and smoky, we got to bring our own air. So this is a tank full of air that we bring in with us. Bad guy. Now he's a good guy. He's a good guy, Calvin. Calvin. Okay. <laughs> but he's not a he's not a bad guy. He's a good guy. That's a good guy, Calvin. He's a fireman. Mm -hmm. He might save you one day from a fire so you don't get burned. Yeah. Yeah, well, but that's it. I'm scared. <laughs> He's nice. That's a fireman. The house is all hot and burning and things. He'll come get you and take you to mommy. Does it look scary? You drop, drop He's your the friend. With the two. That wouldn't hurt you, I yeah. promise. Yeah. Never, ever. Yeah. Take care of cool. He's nice. He's, 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 He's a good guy. Yeah, cool. Is it He's scary? Yeah. 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 Cool. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. I'm going to go shake his hand. Let's shake his hand. Look at his mask. You can touch it. This is how he breathes. Do you want to touch it, Garth? Yeah. Now look. Go see something. Whoa. Do it. Do it. See, he's got a coat on and that's his mask. Feel it. No. Come here, come here. He's scared. He had to carry you out of the fire. Is that his mask? Do you want to touch it? Do you want to touch it? Get a fire. He's not scary, man. He's a good man. You want to go up, Lisa? He's a good man. Calvin, look. Where's she? Calvin. So if he comes in your house and it's burning, if, he, if Grandma's house catches on fire, would you go to him and he'll take you to Mommy? Huh? That's what I'm asking now, but he's a fire. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do, to save you. Yeah. No. I don't want to go with him. I don't want to go with him. Only if it's, only if there's a fire. See, he's taking his mask off. Yeah. See, just me. Wow, wow cool. Yeah. You want to touch it? It's cool. It doesn't hurt. No? 
He has to. He has it's not to scary, is it? Uh, it's a little bit no, scary. Would it be less scary if you touched it once? No, it wouldn't be less. Scary. You want to touch it? Yes, but Would it be less scary if you put it on? Hey. You want Daddy to put it on? Yeah, because it's glass. He'll put it on. Look, Daddy's gonna put it on. Daddy's gonna put it on.
He's like, oh, okay. If he asks for help, then you can help, okay? Okay. <laughs> and I'll put my finger to the back. Is there any help? Yes. I take two or three pictures just for that. Like a mop. This mop. 
Heather gave him a baseball stand where he can hit the ball.